Hey everybody, Fubert7 here and welcome back to the channel with the prediction for the first team of ones to watch. Yes, I said first team because I really think that we're going to have two teams this year. If you think about the promos that we saw last year on uh, FIFA 21, they were all uh, two weeks, two teams, okay? It was always like that, so I think EA will keep going like that. And let's be honest, this transfer window was so crazy, but so crazy that yeah uh, <laughs> there's gonna be two teams anyway um you do notice from yesterday's video there are some players missing of course some of them will go to the second team and i tried to include more uh, leagues i try not to have too many psg players because let's be honest there is a lot of psg players that could be on the ones to watch so i did my research i changed the uh, tactics to go with the with the four back and this will be my prediction for the first team of uh, wants to watch so again we continue with the Donnarumma let's be honest there wasn't that many big goalkeepers transfers this year and I think Donnarumma because he is um, he is a um, um, European champion he's a shoe win definitely he is a shoe win definitely then second we have Hector Bellerin why did I put Hector Bellerin well first of all he played so many years on um, on Arsenal and then now moving back to Spain, it is it was a surprise, I have to admit. And he's usually, um, at least to start the games like the, the, the season of FIFA, he is a favorite. He is a favorite uh, to have a ones to watch. Uh, people like to play with him because he's super pacey, at least to start the game with. I think, uh, and we need low rated players. So how will EA troll us? Like, if they give, like, my team yesterday to give that exact team that I said yesterday everyone's gonna have an overpowered player at the start of the game cycle and uh, EA won't want that so Hector Bellerin then uh, White same reason as Hector Bellerin and he was like 50 million pounds or euros or something like that I know this man was more expensive than Varane and Ronaldo together that's what I know and it's a big signing uh, from Arsenal so I really think I was gonna be him or the goalkeeper which I didn't include in my predictions to be honest on team one or team two then Alaba for the reasons that I mentioned yesterday Alaba is going to be in definitely it has to be like he has very big shoes to fill R Ramos left and um, Varane left so yeah he has big shoes to fill then you have Vandal because Portugal now is a top 5 league, yes, it's a top 5 league, they pushed France back to 6th place. Uh, and he was, um, you, you, well, what I want to say is he usually had special cards, so it's a card that he likes to play with. And him going to Porto, it's quite interesting. And uh, I think Portugal needs some love in the main team. So I'm going to put Vandal in, I think Vandal might be uh, a one to watch. But of all of these, this is the less favorite, I would say. This one, I might get it wrong. But again, it's my prediction. Sabitzer, for the reason that I said yesterday, and of course, I wanted to include the Bundesliga here. So I got Sabitzer. Then we got Rinaldo. And like, he's a very good transfer, like from Liverpool to PSG. PSG was needing a midfield. I never liked a PSG midfield, to be honest. But the same reasons as yesterday. Then, Coop Meiners, is that how I say this name? The Dutch guy. Oh no, no, they don't like Dutch now, it's Netherlander now. I think I like it like that now. Knowledge, I give you knowledge, guys. Netherlander, I think. Uh, <laughs> yeah, last year he had like, not, not six, but I know three or four informs. So he was showing off a lot last year. Let's see how, it, how he's going to be on the, the Atlanta side. So I really think uh, everyone's going to have an, uh, an eye on him because last year on FIFA, a lot of special cards. And of course, he did a very good performance. Uh, he was on PSV. I don't remember, but I think. But I know he was in Holland. Then Messi, Ronaldo and Lukaku. The same reasons as last year. Uh, sorry, not last year. Last video. Uh, same reason as last video. They MVP of Serie A best goal scorer of Serie A and Ronaldo coming home Lukaku I don't want to say Lukaku coming back home but it's like 
coming back to prove a point because I think I don't consider it its home because I, I would say Everton is its home because they're the ones that gave him an opportunity to grow and become the player he is today and then Messi on his first outside of Spain adventure uh, yeah it's gonna be interesting uh, like I said yesterday who I would like to pull from all of these definitely Ronaldo everyone like I'm gonna say 90% of the people that will open and wants to watch back from the pre-order they are going to say I want Ronaldo and I want Ronaldo and I know they're gonna say that um, yeah EA has everything to start the season with a blast with the blast this is probably I know they're gonna there's gonna be other promos but this is a blast to start the, this the FIFA season with but this with this no this is way too good way too good so guys that's my prediction for the first team of the ones to watch tomorrow there will be a second uh, ones to watch team which I will take right after this uh, guys please leave a like a comment hit the bell icon you know all those good things that make us grow like there's going to be something up here something over there be sure to click it and uh, i will see you on the next video guys thank you so much for being here bye